Albion is a city in and the county seat of Edwards County, Illinois, United States. The population was 1,988 at the 2010 census. The city was named, Albion, after an ancient and poetic reference to the island of Great Britain. Geography <laughs> <laughs> Albion is located south of the center of Edwards County at 38 degrees 22 minutes 38 seconds north 88 degrees 3 minutes 40 seconds west 38.377300 minus 88.061028 in it Illinois Route 130 and Illinois Route 15 meet Route 130 leads north 25 miles 40 km to Oney and south 10 miles 16 km to Grayville, while Route 15 leads east 16 miles 26 km to Mount Carmel and west 16 miles 26 km to Fairfield. According to the 2010 census, Albion has a total area of 2.196 square miles, 5.69 square kilometers, of which 2.15 square miles, 5.57 square kilometers or 97.91% is land and 0.046 square miles, 0.12 square kilometers or 2.09% is water. A 3.8 magnitude earthquake occurred seven and a half miles outside of the city on September 19, 2017. Climate History Albion was laid out in 1818 as a utopian community, and given the name Albion, a literary name for England, in 1821, the county seat of Edwards County was moved from Palmyra to Albion. However, residents of Mount Carmel felt their town should be the county seat. Four companies of militia marched from Mount Carmel towards Albion to seize the county documents stored in the courthouse. The situation was eventually resolved in 1824 by separating Wabash County from Edwards County at Bonpas Creek. The resulting counties remain two of the smallest in Illinois. Demographics <inaudible> 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 As of the census of 2000, there were 1,933 people, 861 households, and 538 families residing in the city. The population density was 903.8 people per square mile .8 per square kilometers. There were 957 housing units at an average density of 447.5 per square miles, 172.7 per square kilometers. The racial makeup of the city was 98.71% white, 0.16% African American, 0.10% Native American, 0.57% Asian, 0.21% from other races, and 0.2 6% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 0.57% of the population. There were 861 households out of which 26.7% had children under the age of 18 living with them, 51.5% were married couples living together, 9.5% had a female householder with no husband present, and 37.4% were non-families. 34.5% of all households were made up of individuals and 19.4% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.20 and the average family size was 2.82. 
In the city, the population was spread out with 21.6% under the age of 18, 7.3% from 18 to 24, 24.0% from 25 to 44, 22.8% from 45 to 64, and 24.3% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 43 years. For every 100 females, there were 83.7 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 80.3 males. The median income for a household in the city was $29,476, and the median income for a family was $36,917. Males had a median income of $26,182 versus $17,375 for females. The per capita income for the city was $14,747. About 8.6% of families and 12.2% of the population were below the poverty line, including 19.0% of those under age 18 and 9.3% of those age 65 or over. Notable people Harold Huntley Bassett, U.S. Air Force Major General Morris Birkbeck, 1st Illinois Secretary of State, one of Albion's founders Louis Lincoln Emerson, served as Secretary of State of Illinois and Governor of Illinois Benjamin Orange Flower, journalist Edward Fordham Flower, English brewer Harold A. Garman, U.S. Army Medic and Medal of Honor recipient in World War II Guy U. Hardy, former congressman from Colorado Jeff Keener, former pitcher for the St. Louis Cardinals H. H. Colsart, publisher and confidant of five U.S. presidents George Frederick Pentecost, prominent clergyman, evangelist and co-worker with revivalist D. L. Moody William Pickering, fifth governor of Washington Territory Bruce Mendenhall, convicted murderer and alleged serial killer